Hello, hello everyone. Welcome again to my channel, Xeno Vision. Today I'm going to be showing you how you can download, install, and play with a Natural Vision remastered version for your Grand Theft Auto or 5M game. With this plugin, your game graphics will look amazing. Trust me, I've installed it and played with it. So before we go any further, I would love for you all to smash that like button, hit that subscribe button so you can start following my channel. We also have a Discord channel, so feel free to join as well. Also, this video is for educational and entertainment purposes only. So let's get started. For this plugin, uh, you'll have to visit a website where you can download the Natural Vision. Uh, it's going to be a quick and easy install. I'm going to guide you through the process. And with that said, let's first hop over to my Discord. The link will be in the description. So when uh, hopping over to my Discord, this is my Discord. We have a support page. If you have any support questions or you can't get it uh, to work, just open a Discord ticket and uh, support ticket and we will get back to you as soon as possible. We have currently 190 members and 10 more members and we'll give a free uh, Nitro away. We already did a at 100 for Cartman, so yes. Uh, going back to the tutorial, if you go to resources, you can click on this link and you'll be redirected to this web page. Uh, so we're gonna go and download Natural Vision Remastered for this tutorial, and you're just gonna hit download, and it's just gonna download the file after you click on this. So I've already downloaded it. After you download it, you can just hit, uh, right click on it and click on WinRAW and extract to natural vision so it will go ahead and extract it uh i've already done it after that you can open up the folder this is what you will see okay so the first thing you want to do is you want to uh, have open iv installed on your computer if you don't have open iv i will leave also the link in the resources page it is very easy let's open up open iv for the first time so this is the link up of open iv the link is not working as you can see so going back to my discord server at resources you can see right here we have the open iv version uh, you can just click on it and you can download open iv it will go ahead and download it right here just let it load up so there's currently a problem with the web page of open iv that's why it's not working just right click on it and go to winraw extract to open iv setup let it load up oh it's already there then here, double click on it, hit next, continue, and let it install while loading. So here you can just hit continue, etc., etc. I'm not, gonna, I'm gonna skip that part. It's just installing. After it's done, you can go ahead and open up Open IV, but do it as an administrator for the first time, okay? So you search for Open IV in your Windows, right click, run as administrator, hit OK. Uh, Grand Theft Auto Windows. So if you open up this for the first time, uh, you'll have to uh, allow the ASI manager to also uh, uh, install the packages and also give it administration privileges. So here, right now, you just hit what can I do? Set permissions. That's done. Let it load up. And after it's loaded up, close. Then you go to Tools, ASI manager. And these ones are green with me. If this is the first time you installed it, just hit install, 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 because then they're blue. After that, that's done. You can close it down. That's it. If you haven't had I open IV until now, we're done right there. So let's go back to the natural vision remastered. Uh, here we have the installer version. Double click on it. Oh yeah, one thing that I forgot to mention about the open IV, it will ask you in one of those three blue ones to create a mods folder, press yes. Uh, so press yes on creating a mods folder. Okay, so natural vision gonna hit install and then install to mods folder. It's that easy. Okay, it will load and then it's done So that's cool uh, So after this you have natural vision installed on your Grand Theft Auto 
main directory folder. Now, this tutorial is specifically for the 5M version. So it's already installed on Grand Theft Auto. You can test it out on this point if you only want it for Grand Theft Auto. We want it for 5M. So we're going to go to the optional add-ons. And here you'll have a 5M folder. And then you will get the optional packages, which uh, we'll come back in soon. We'll have the main package. This one, we're going to drag and drop in our 5M application folder. As you can see, I already have it here. You just drag and drop it, and that's it. Then the optional package is for whatever else you want in it, like brighter system. You click on it, you go into add-ons, and you just drag and drop it. So you can choose the files which you want from here in your Grand Theft Auto main directory folder and it will get added to it. It's that easy. Uh, what else is important if we go back? So here you have options for your Grand Theft Auto. Uh, we also have main files. That's the last one. These two. We're going to select these two and we're going to drag and drop them in our Grand Theft Auto main directory folder. So after you're done with these add-ons, yeah, we're going to go to our Grand Theft Auto main directory folder. So make sure you know where that is. For me, it's here. You're going to select these two files and you're going to drag and drop them. Well, I already have them. After that, you are done. So the next step for us is to start up Grand Theft Auto 5M and to see if it works. So let's go ahead and do that. Okay, it's loading up. So what have we done until now? Just to be clear, we have installed Natural Vision Remastered. I've showed you how to install Open Ivy, which is also necessary. And we have extracted those files. We have installed the, the natural vision on Grand Theft Auto. After that, we installed the add-ons in our 5M application folder. And then we did, uh, I showed you how to do an optional package like brightness. You can just drag and drop it in that add-ons folder. And the last thing we did is we copied the two files to our Grand Theft Auto main directory folder. It is that easy. Now let's uh, let it load up. This is a good time for you all to smash that like button and hit that subscribe button so you can start following my channel. So let's skip this part. Okay, okay, folks, it is started up. As you can see, it is beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And I'm currently in the Kelly RP server for whoever is wondering. This is the best server out there. Uh, if you need any assistance, if you want to partner up, if you want to be an LEPD cop, join me in my server, Discord server, and I will tell you and guide you through how to get here. So let's go ahead and open up a vehicle just to see, show you also how the lighting is. Go for the heat dodge. Oh no. Oh, I love this car. Damn, just look at the colors, man. Let's see. And I did the motion blur, as you can see. Damn. Okay, the motion blur, I can, it's on high density, but I'm going to change that to medium or low. Because that is really high. Only focus on the vehicle, as you can see. Yeah. See, that can, that can make me a bit dizzy. Oh, 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 that's not going good. The car is already broken. It's just... So yeah, people, as you can see, it is lovely. So if I look on my screen, by the way, damn, damn, what am I doing? Oh yeah, uh, my OBS studio has some lag, but in the game, it has no lag, by the way. So sorry about that. Let's see. Yeah, it's, it's 
It's because of the very high graphics. My computer has no lag. Yeah, I can definitely see some lag here and there, but not in the game. So it is beautiful, folks. The coloring, the, the, the lighting, the details around me. I love it. I love it. So yeah, that's about it for this tutorial. I hope you liked it. If so, please smash that like button. Hit that subscribe button so you can start following my channel. See, even now I see the lag in the recording. So that's because some setting in OBS, I guess. But yeah, thank you all for watching and goodbye.